Alrighty, back for game two of week eight. We're rolling along. Um, things are getting spicy. Standings. The big spice. Standings are, I don't know if you've seen that this morning or not, but um, at the end of week seven, the standings are insanely close. <clears throat> and, um, we'll have to, as the weeks go, we'll have to get that on the board for each matchup but tonight um in case you didn't hear i do have edak in the booth with me tonight um and we, are, we are gonna go and we're just gonna chit chat about uh the row ice and team conspiracy game uh, you know how, how it's gonna be you know how it is. Speaking of the uh, the leaderboard, there we got Row Ice coming in this game with one loss on the season. They are uh, uh, currently in second place, uh, right behind Vivid Polar. Vivid Polar, I think, has a tied game over Row Ice. Has uh, 18 points. Row Ice has 17. Team Conspiracy, uh, right in about the the middle of the pack here, uh, sitting currently in se- what is that? Tied for second. Not tied. Sorry, they are in uh, seventh place, sixth place, seventh place, something like that. Numbers are hard, but they are sitting at three and four with ten points on the season. Uh, anything can happen for them. Uh, they can they can take this right on uh, into uh, into the major here. So it'd be a, a good one for them to pick up here on Row Ice. Uh, Row Ice is want to keep that streak going. Yeah, it's. The, I mean, from three down, it, the standings are so close. It's super close. Uh, it's mm-hmm. actually pretty. It's going to be probably our closest finish yet. Yeah, but, I, I will absolutely agree with that. I mean, even even tied for fourth place right now, we have a three-way tie for fourth place at 11 points. Yeah. It's going to be crazy. pretty wild. We might have some uh we might have to have some extra games this season. Depending oh, on Lord. how those standings go, we we may have to have some tiebreakers depending on let's, how they all lay out. Let's bring them on. Can't wait to see them. But let's take a look real quick at the roster. 3 2 1. <clears throat> and uh we got Pre-Fire, Maven, Nova, Not Okay, and Sardine. I do believe everybody is there this week. Um, and then on the other side, we have Rock and Roll, Blunder, Toxic, uh, Quid- Quidany? Quidany? Uh, Quid- I'm Quid- going to call him Quidditch. Quid- okay. And Tigers. And um, I do believe Rock is not there tonight, but we have Yummy sticking in. Uh, he's going to he's gonna fill that void tonight yeah um we want to take a look at the uh the player stats themselves uh we can a pre-fire uh is just running right now just sprinting ahead with a 2.3 kd and 21 entry kills he currently has a a a plus 15 uh, entry kd I think that might be the highest in the league so far. Not only that, but he's sitting with 106 kills, which I also believe is highest in the league at this point. Yeah, it's it's some crazy he's fragging. Doing okay, he's doing all right. Yeah, it's 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 not okay. It's uh, it's 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 really good. <laughs> he's he's had a really good season uh, so far. 106 kills, 46 deaths. Right behind him, we got Nova here with 82 kills and 50 deaths, coming in with a 1.64 KD. Uh, both those leading the team um, pretty pretty solidly here. Uh, they have been doing a lot for the team and really kind of tossing them on their uh, toss them in the backpack here. Uh, so they're they're doing a lot of good stuff, and I think the team as a whole is uh, working really well together, uh, getting a lot of good info out there, get a lot of uh, good intel, and uh, being able to get some of these guys their kills, uh, which has eventually essentially led them into their six and one uh, record so far. So good on them for that. Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> on the other side, we got Team Conspiracy, uh, top of their. Kill board here is Tigers sitting with uh, 67 kills, 
uh, and 44 deaths, giving him a 1.52 KD. Uh, and he actually is a plus three uh, entry frag. So he's got uh, he's got six entry kills and three entry deaths. So he's doing pretty pretty good there on the, the entry side. So this will be a, a good test uh, to put each one of them up against each other and see how they kind of play out. Uh, right behind Tigers, we got uh, Coyote, or uh, now is just uh, Toxic, TXC, uh, sitting with 59 kills and 57 deaths, just keeping his nose above that 1.0 KD there. Uh, and Blunder right behind him with 42 and 40 with a 1.05. Uh, really, the entirety of Team Conspiracy is sitting a, uh, almost above a 1.0 KD. So they're they're doing really good. They're getting the frags. They're getting everything out there. It just looks like uh, they may have had uh, a few rough matches so far this season, giving them that 3-4 and four record. Yeah, the last one was definitely uh, leave a sour taste in their mouth. Ended up having to be in a 4v5, which... You know, we can make all the rules to cover that, but the that particular situation um, can't do anything about. So you know, they're they're definitely ready to get back out there and uh, try to try to get something back off of that. Um, but well, <clears throat> as a uh, a rough segue here, right after we look at uh, the clubhouse that we're going to be going to, uh, if you got that sour taste in your mouth from that last game make sure you uh go get you a nice cold refreshing water uh with epic water filters uh using code bro league that'll get you i think it's 20 percent off it's a it's a hefty little percentage uh their cups are really nice has a nice little uh filter down there at the bottom of the straw I, uh, you, you can even take their filters like the outdoor filters stick it into a stream and just drink straight out of the stream so they say Yummy. I'll test that for everyone and let you know. But yeah, we're going to be going to Clubhouse. This is uh, this almost feels like a throwback to uh, season one and season two here, where everyone was going to Clubhouse all the time. Clubhouse in Oregon, it's back to back seen, every other week. It's it's still still been picked fairly high this season. Eh, it, it does get a, a good pick rate. Uh, I've seen a lot more cafe um, this season. I feel like I'm still waiting on someone. And maybe they have, and I just missed the match while I was out of the house but to play theme park. Has anyone played theme yet? I don't believe so. Okay, I didn't figure so, but that's, we have seen Scott. That's unfortunate. But... Well, well, let's throw it. Let's throw it to our boys at uh, EWF, and we'll be right back. We are here, yeah. Got to double check something real quick while before we get too far into this. No worries. My taskbar is deciding that it doesn't want to minimize, and it's blocking a whole bunch of stuff on my screen. Blocking so that's all the fun. Blocking all the haters and multiple bits of information. Okay, we should be good now. We should be good. Okay. Game audio was uh, unlinked for some reason again. I don't know why I decided to look, but I did. <clears throat> and I'm glad I did. Well, glad you did. We're just not going to hide the taskbar. How about that? Take that. Uh, first, we got Thatcher off the board and Finca right behind him, getting that LMG off uh, Cade or Kaid, whichever way you prefer. Uh, getting taken off here. Pretty standard ban so far, especially for people who dislike the LMGs. Uh, last one, who do you think, Mira? Um, 
or Valk, but it's Mira. It's always Mira. Shake my head, my hips. Love it. Going into round one here, Team Conspiracy versus Roe Ayas. Uh, love it. Uh, I love seeing the, uh, the uh, everything's a first matchup of the season. It's your, it's your one and only matchup. You got to do some good scouting to start with. You got to know what the other team plays, how they play, and there's plenty of information out there. Uh, so uh, instead of playing teams twice in the season like we did in, uh, last season, uh we're going once this, once once this season, which is uh, pretty cool. We do have a Rooney getting picked up. We're going to have some holes punched in some walls here. Jaeger and Bandit, Thunderbird and Azami. Uh, on the attacking side, Maverick, Nomad, Sledge, Ace, and Zofia. going to be honest. If we played everyone twice in this particular Attackers season, I would not bomb. make it. It would, it's, would be No, it would almost be six months. It would be an eternity. Yeah, it would be uh, 20, 22 weeks, I think. And there's 52 weeks in a year. So, yeah, over. No, not over, but close to half a, half a year. It would be, it, I, you know, what's funny is I don't think it still wouldn't be as long as season one was. Nothing can top how long season one was. Let's be completely honest here. No one... Uh, no one can beat that. It took so long. Ooh, there's no sound coming through Parsec. Is that correct? Um, That's okay. We can finish. We can look at it here in a little bit. Yeah, it, I'll have to adjust something. Oh, yeah, it's probably in the screen, maybe. I don't know. Anyway, I, I know what I know what it is. All right. All right. Well, they're gonna come on up and see if they can get this wall opened up. They're gonna map it. He is going right through that just so quickly. Easily done. They're going to go ahead and try to get this maybe undone. Takes a little bit of damage here from the electricity. Does it again just to show people he ain't skirt. You know what? It does not go soft. Okay uh, he's missing that left bit there. Yep, so it is. But it looks like he doesn't really care. They're going to try to open it up, but Blunder getting taken down. That's that first entry frag pre-fire getting Blunder right off the bat here. Sorry, Jeff. Uh, whenever you watch this back, I am not doing the, the stats for you. This is uh, uh, Quidditch Quidani. taking a little bit of damage. Quidani's first game in the Bro League. He's firing right above that man's head. He's trying his best to see if he can get something out of this. Going ahead and droning out, seeing if he can find anybody on the other side. He does see. Is he able to get a ping down to get some shots through? Maybe not. He's going to shoot in the general direction here. Nova taking a tremendous amount of damage, but getting healed right back up, up on Catwalk. Quid and uh, Toxic being very low right now. Um, that's not a good sign for them, but they have opened up this balcony uh, wall. Going to get a frag in there, trying to take out Maven on top of Red, but nothing's going to happen. Nova's going to take a little bit of damage here. They got some pings down on bottom floor. Not okay is going to be creeping in through blue, and that's not the way that Maven's going to be looking. Wrong button. Is not okay going to get the swing? I think he's going to sit here and hold for a minute, see if he can make sure that no one's going to rotate around this bottom area. Sardine getting a lot of damage here, and so much, in fact, that he gets taken out by Quid. Yeah, they've moved up into construction here. Look, it got a backside push along with this main wall. Yummy gets taken out Yummy. by the fire on the, on the balcony. Oh, and Tiger's that's down as well by an... Hate to see it, but Toxic's getting picked back up, so we got Toxic and Quid. The last two available for the Conspirators. Toxic going down. One lone Conspirator left, and pre is going to get the kill. Hopping out the window, getting some shots inside, and getting the kill. You hate to see the TK, man. <clears throat> it's part of the game, I suppose. Can we uh, see if we get some sound back? Yes. Thank you, sir. Well, 
we'll have to do this here. All in all, a pretty good round, though. <clears throat> Team Conspiracy came in. Uh, it looked like they had a pretty good, a decent plan coming in. But uh, Prefire uh, getting quite a few kills here. Quidney getting uh, a, a decent amount for his first showing here, including one of his own. That's, uh, that's a rough one to start with. I do hear sound. Thank you. Yeah, 4K coming out of Prefire. <laughs> So no ace with the TK on board. See, that was the whole plan. They didn't want to give him another ace. Uh, Prefire does have one ace on the season so far. And Quid looked at the stats. He said, I'm not going to give you that second ace. Not on my team. Not on my watch. Not my chairs. Not my problem. You come down to the basement. They are going to get this dirt reinforced. <clears throat> See if we get any punchies. Wall secured. Ten seconds remaining. <clears throat> Five seconds to insertion. Maybe we already missed them. <clears throat> All right, that's going in. Gonna go ahead and open up there. Easy enough to open up for them here. Gonna get a little, oh, little pre-fire. Down right off the bat. There's multiple people in kitchen though. He's up there with him. Oh, and he's gonna get revived. Yeah, pre-fire's gonna run right back downstairs. Hopefully gonna get uh, a couple of heals here and get right back up to near full health. Gonna go for that last one and he's he's back up. That's why Thunderbird is so big. <laughs> yeah, the absolute power of Thunderbird to be able to just toss those down and you get completely downed, you get picked right back up and go right over and you're back at full health. It's a brand new life. Gotta love it. I don't believe there's any room to worry about. So they pretty much just have to um, try to get something on the site going. Whitney making some holes, gonna see oh, if he can toss a grenade down there to oh, pick somebody it, up. It does damage, but not enough. Gonna slam that floor, see if he can find anybody down there holding out. Nothing to be found. Getting that kitchen hatch open. And take a quick view downstairs. They do see someone is in the meeting room here, or in church rather. Toxic pressuring down on the main stairs. Other than uh, other than looking through the kitchen floor, it's about all we got going as of right now for the attack. We are, yeah, we are about under a minute left. Uh, it's going to be a little rough one for them. They're going to get a little bit of intel here from Tigers. Nothing that they're going to be able to see, uh, and he is going to lose. Ooh, free fire getting that entry frag on the toxic right on the stairs. What a shot by Tigers onto pre-fire. Incredible aim. Gonna turn and take a look down this hallway, see if we can find anybody. No one's gonna be peeking it though. We got a couple looking towards blue. Getting a little pinch there. He's gonna open up. See if he can get inside. Tigers taking a bit of damage, but not as much as Maven did. Sardines getting a little poke on the Tigers, but not enough to get a kill. Tigers, in fact, tigers. Quad. quad kill. Does Tigers get the ace? We're waiting for it. We've got 10 seconds left on the clock. He's going to hold his location here, but they do know where he's at. Diffuser's going down. He does not get the kill. Nova getting the double kill. That was so close to an ace for Tigers. Gotta feel like they saw him on the default cam. The nomad is going out. Probably on that on that door right there. No, nope, not. Triple for Nova. Oh wow. my gosh! Oh. That was close. If he didn't flash there, I think Nova gets the 4K and clutches it out. <clears throat> and Nova had to just sprint and hope he could find some cover and take a little shots every now and again. But that was rough. Well, we got a couple people getting some 4Ks. 
um 4k from tigers there one shy um but nova nova ends that with a 3k of his own uh pre-fire had the 4k in round one um man high action over here yeah what what a round they are absolutely putting on a show here tigers just trying his best there to to get that to get that ace it was very close Gonna go ahead and roll it. Is it okay on your end? Uh, I am good on my end. It's I get a, I get a little chop every now and again. The stream is what I was looking at. Uh, it looked like a few times I was getting a little choppy. Perfect. But I'm doing okay. <laughs> if ain't nobody complaining, ain't nothing wrong with it. If anyone happens to notice anything, okay. Quiz says it was for just a minute, but it's fine now. Noel says just a tad, but not too bad. How did that first one flash a Rooney? I don't know. I guess it just just happened. Looks like we're gonna have a rehost.
okay, well, you're never going to believe this. We believe what? What's, what's, uh, I'm talking to the stream. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> so, we are back in a, another 4v5. Whoop, whoop. Someone was not able to continue because a fuse blew in their house. That is uh, the story being relayed. And the game has started, so... That's unfortunate. We have to roll it. Defenders, protect your bombs from being <laughs> well, by attackers. Back to the here basement. we are. They are gonna Back to where we were before the rehose. So, again. love to see it. Now, here's the thing. They got the gunners to do what they need to do. That is, oh, they absolutely can, yeah. That is for certain. So, we will see how, uh, how that plays out. So much quieter with only four people. <laughs> yeah, I mean, what's going on? Crazy. <clears throat> anyway, back here, Roa is doing an extra on defensive work here. They have uh, the the Valkyrie here, hoping to give them a little extra intel when they can get it. They are just. Ooh. He tries for the peak, but Nova gets taken out. Just wow. It looks like Blender might be typing something. Well, I respect it. You're trying to even it up, you know. Yeah, I mean, you gotta do what you gotta do, I guess, whenever it's 4v5. He did wait. He was waiting the, the 10 seconds there before he yeah. actually it, peeked it, out. Yeah. So. All Ooh, good here. First lovely. frag. Tiger's on a maven here. No, oh, I'm sorry, that's not first frag. Nova was already down. That's right. Yeah, he died in the maven getting down as well. Spawn peak. The peak there. They might get aggressive on this 4v5. <laughs> We're going to try and live and die with uh, with Roias on this, given that they're in a 5v2 already. Sardine is going to be in a world of trouble over there by himself with all that destructibility above him. I only see four of the conspiracy players. Um, the other is pushing blue, it seems. Oh, and he gets... Oh, the shot going in. Pre-fire doing what his name says. Pre-firing. Making a little, making it a little more uh, doable. More drones coming out. Sardine just sees some feet up there in the hatch. Not playing Mr. Feet, but he'll take him when he can find him. Getting some shots down the hall. Nothing there. He's going to take a peek back up oh. at Kitchen Hold. He sees a head, potentially. But they see him first. Blunder taking out Sardine, leaving us with pre-fire. The lone person left here. Trying to get the shots. Tigers headshot to pre-fire for that last kill of the round. And this is going to be tough. Never, it's never an easy thing to overcome, just being a man down. Yeah, they're they're gonna have to try to do something here, and I think they they have been trying with uh, uh, trying to get that peak to start with. I think that was a good start, uh, but you know it, it it didn't work out. 
Uh, and he actually, he was very close to that 10 second mark. I think it was at the 11 or 12 second mark that he actually peeked around and looked out. Yeah. I remember seeing it was, I do know it was very close. I think, um, mm -hmm. See what we got for round four. Conspiracy has the one round lead. They are back up to cash. Ten seconds to go. Five seconds left before insertion. All right. Attackers must locate and defuse the bomb. Back up we go. If after They're this round, written. if it still seems choppy, we may just have to give you a choppy stream versus uh, everyone else. That is perfectly fine. No worries there. Going to try and get this wall opened up, see if they have a better attempt at that this time. Are running around with the Azami. Nova is playing Garage. Maybe gets a C4 rip, but. Oh, very close. Doesn't quite get through there. Toxic is trying to blow up the bandit batteries from below. Maven's gonna get Maven. that entry fag onto Tigers through the map hole. What a play for Maven there. And, and then to get out and not get killed, great, great play. That's going to even, even us up at four. Yeah, we'll, uh, we'll redo it. Walls opening. Toxic getting some information. I know there's a couple on site. Fire in bedroom. Gonna see if he can uh, maybe sneak something around here, but quitting and getting taken out by Maven. That's a double kill from Maven. <clears throat> this gives Roe Eyes the uh, the numbers advantage here. Three to four. Peeking around there, he does hear some footsteps, but he doesn't seem to know exactly where from. Toxic jumps in and gets Nova out of garage. E4 coming out, but it misses. Free fire peeks on out and gets Toxic out of sight. And it's still a 3v2 in favor of the defending team. Maven with the triple. I know the last one's out on the balcony. Who's gonna get it? Place your bets, place your bets. Like a like a group of lions just trying to find a way to get their prey here. Three of them just starting to swarm and surround him. You could see his butt there if he took a little bit of a look. But he's looking for a headshot here and almost gets it as Yummy goes almost all the way down. But Yummy gets pre-fire with the Let's headshot first. One. Sardine goes Nothing. ahead and takes him out and finishes it out. Uh, let's go ahead and switch this stream real quick. Hey, kill kill this one uh, and, and toss it up on the uh, on the Discord. That that'll be fine for me. And um, as long as that's gonna work for you. Yep, yep. Cool. Should be fine. Just won't be as good for you. That's fine. Hopefully. Hopefully, incoming. <clears throat> there we are. We are gonna go ahead and close that completely. Well, let's close this just in case. Close all of the things. All right. Hopefully that does it for you guys. They are going bedroom and gym. I 
I don't know. All it right. worked better for me and Jeff when we did it, but I'm not sure what's up. Oh no, is there any storms out your way? There's some storms coming early, through over yes. here, but... Yeah, there's some storms coming through over here, but that doesn't usually mess with my uh, connectivity, so who knows? Maybe it's a setting on my side I need to, to work around with. All right. They got the early picks they needed last round. Let's see if they can continue that. All the rotations in the world back into bathroom and gym. Just kidding. It's only, it's only three. All you need. They don't have any rotates into construction, and they don't seem to be worrying about cash side too much with reinforcements. <coughs> but it could just be because they haven't had time to do all of it yet. Uh, I yeah, I think that's probably part of it. They don't have enough manpower to to get over there and get everything kind of worked out. Plus. Um, moving them over there into cash is going to get them kind of uh, uh, spread out a bit. So they won't be able to rotate as quickly. Uh, and you're going to have less people over towards the point. They might be going straight into sight here. They might just go ahead and try and get in. I think you're right. I think they're going to give it a go, see if they can find anybody right here on this corner. And I don't think they're going to find anyone. But he's going to hold. Dox is going to hold this location, see if he can find. I think they want to open up that door there, or that wall. Maybe? Oh, opening the bathroom wall now. Oh, he sees the head. The C4 comes out. He does get out of there. His pre-fire now with his his C4 is gone. Foxic holding a tight angle on that bathroom door. Yeah, that's uh Here's that is a thing. very small angle for him to get. Here's the thing though. We um we only have a minute left and this is all they've done. Yeah. Uh, not much is going on here. Uh, yeah. They have a man advantage here. Uh, they just haven't played it out Maybe here, but it's back it to four all now. Yep, Yummy is, they are getting onto these windows now that there's, uh, they're realizing that they're almost out of time. <laughs> yummy peeking this gym window. Having a battle with get, Nova. Get some quick little shots here. Uh, not going to catch anything, but it's going to get a flashbang inside and probably going to hop right in. They not happening right now and a good call. squeaks through. Toxic is down from pre-fire. He can in that bathroom door. Tigers finishes, uh, kills Sardine. Oh, and Yummy falls down. He's the last one left. Oh, uh, unfortunate here for Team Conspiracy. Getting taken out by Nova at the end. But man, what a play by Ro Ayas. Being able to take a two in a row now uh, while they're a man down. That's uh, some serious play here. Well, they just wasted. They wasted a lot of time. Um, you know, they held them off just pre-firing, sending some bullets out their way. Um, they weren't able to uh, get anything other than that going. But then he <laughs> tried to drop, um, drop Lodgy Hatch, I believe, and Maven took him out to get that first kill off on the board. And then after that, it was kind of just. Uh, Onslaught. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> it's really sad about it. <laughs> well, we can all tell who Kaysen's rooting for. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, uh, having having a four-man uh, hold here is difficult. I'm going to be very interested to see after this round how they do on a four-man attack. Something Going to bar stage. Okay. I, I think you're probably right. Like uh, like I was saying earlier, with uh, Pre-Fire having a, was it a plus 15 uh, entry frag KD? It's just crazy. Yep. They're going bar stock. Wait, I guess it's what? It's bar stage now? Yeah, that's what I, that's what I call it. <clears throat> bar stage. 
I think it's the easiest way to call it. That, whether or not that's the actual name, I couldn't tell you, so I'm assuming you know it better than I do. <laughs> Nova playing over in Strip. Free fire on the roam somewhere, most likely upstairs. Hey, I don't see him. Maybe he's in basement. I don't know where he is. He's somewhere on the map. Let's just find him this way. Okay, he's upstairs. <laughs> I was going to say, all you got to do is just click on his name. <laughs> he is upstairs hiding so well that we can't even find him with overhead cams. Who is that? Mr. Feet himself. Oh, we do have a Mr. Feet. They are going to be looking out for anybody moving around there. And we got an Amber Alert. Anything that can make noise and be a distraction, it's going to happen tonight. Like, this is... This is scuff stream right here. Uh, it doesn't get much more scuffed. And he's off the board. He does find him there. Great intel, bringing him to a 5-3. But yeah, like you said. To go. Even getting that refrag here, he does need to fall back, get to some safety. They know where he's at. He's going back downstairs, though, and actually continuing almost all the way downstairs. Gonna see if he can find <clears throat> anyone taking a look, but Quidney going down now. This brings it back to a three all. Oh, Quidney and Toxic both down on Team Conspiracy side. We got the threes here for the last round of Roe Ice's defense. Sorry about all those camera moving things that happened a moment ago. Uh, child was trying to drive an 18 wheeler onto my keyboard. <clears throat> hey, we've all done that. <laughs> we've all drove 18 wheelers on the keyboards. <laughs> Specifically, we've all drove 18 wheelers on your keyboard, Mosey. <clears throat> Maven oh, holding uh, a solid just angle misses here. misses the shots onto Yummy over there on the billiards window. That's a, that's a scary little hold to have right there, seeing if he can find anyone over there on billiards. 30 seconds left, they're going to have to try and push in here and get something going. Blunder does have the, the diffuser coming down those main stairs. Not entirely sure how that flashed him. bulletproof on, the, on them, though. They're getting that intel. Tigers gets one. Nova gets yummy. It's a 2v2. 11 seconds left. Nova gets another for a triple. Blunder gets Nova. It's a 1v1 with four seconds. Plant going down, but where is Maven? Right there, taking shots or right at the man's head. <clears throat> That's a rough spot to be in, especially in a 4v5. You would think that on the attacking side, they'd be able to get in a little bit quicker. Uh, but the defense here, even on a four-man defense, is, is holding really well. Uh, being able to hold them off from being able to push so quickly. They are going to swap now with a 4-2 lead. I'm curious to see, do they even bother with the wall? Um, it looks like they may. Mav and uh, Ace. So it looks like they are going to at least open it up or potentially or have it as an option at least. Attackers need to locate and defuse as many bombs as they Casting can. Casting these games with a two-year-old that is learning to talk is a Makes lot it all that more fun. It, it, I mean, for me, I'm fine with it. You know what I mean? Like, I'm <clears throat> I'm just sitting here hey. enjoying some, some bro league with my, my boy. And, uh... You don't get this kind of entertainment in the pro league. You don't, you don't get two-year-olds learning to talk in the background at the pro league. This you, is bro league. I think one of his favorite things to say is let's go, so let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Attackers must locate. You don't want to do it. Okay. They do bring the <laughs> bandit. Pre-fire on the Mav. Maven on the Ace. Probably just with Kaid gone, they they can actually get it fairly easily. Um, just 
got to keep him off the off of it from tricking the wall. Other than that, it should be okay. Shouldn't be that big of a deal for pre-fire. I think he knows uh, two are already what he gone. needs to do here to get this opened up. Two are already gone on this uh, garage wall here. Maven's thrown two, so he's only going to have one left for this main wall. He's going to be watching that, watching that spot as he maps across. Even if anybody peeks from red. At the deadly spot right there. Yes, it is. Oh, Wonder takes some damage off of it. Oh, what an angle. Nova trying to nade from below. If this hits, that's a kill. And it does. That's an entry nade kill onto Yummy. And we're already in. Wow. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. It's a matter of time. <clears throat> they do get the bandit so, off the wall. There. They do get the bandit off the wall, and it gets opened up. Um, free fire. Throwing some nades. Nova with another nade kill, and <clears throat> we're in a four v two. Give that man a nade and just take away his guns. That's all he needs. He just needs some nades to get some shots here. Pre-fire has about two health left on him. Sneeze in his general direction, and he's out. Quid and Toxic both low on health, but so are Pre-fire and Sardine. But Quid and Toxic are going to have to have oh, a hell of a match there. The well done, bringing it down to a two to three here. He gets another Maven as he comes in. Quit this is looking a little bit better for uh, Team Conspiracy here. <clears throat> Nova, the last man alive, sitting out on the balcony. I don't know that he's going to be able to get in there and do it unless he can get a pick here, and he does not. Defender's taking the round here. Toxic getting the last kill, and Quitney getting a trip. What a, what a round. Big that for Quid there. That kind of turned around from what I thought it was I thought was going to happen. Coming to a 2v4 and then taking the win there. Uh, that, that triple there by Quid was uh, crucial. Yes, it was. It was huge. <clears throat> Excuse me, sir. <clears throat> Thank you. Let's go. Kill feed, but remember this is not counting um, the rehost, so there are some other kills in here that... Um, will be added in once we put them in for the stats. But right now we have Nova as your kill lead with seven, um, and two of those coming off of nades just now. That's honestly crazy. The the not having the entry frags to be able to do that, but be able to get someone from below and time the grenade right is just a, a skill in and of its own. It is a learned skill. And it is not easy. Well, for me, anyways. I've only had a few. I don't know that I've ever killed anybody with a grenade. I'm going to be completely honest here. It's a rough go of it for me. Uh, Ro I is sitting with a 4-3 uh, lead over Team Conspiracy here as we head into round 8. Uh, again, Ro I has been 4v5 for the last 4 rounds. Um, Five rounds. One one, so. so, yeah, si six rounds. They've uh, they've done a lot here. Yep. <clears throat> they've they've battled for sure. So it's um. Wonder, <clears throat> Wonder taking taken half damage. damage. Is he peeking off of the window? I don't see anybody near that window. And he was he was in the basement. Did he did he nade himself or? He has both of his nades still. Hmm. Maybe shotgun. Not sure. Maybe smoke rotate. Not. not that sure could have been. Happened. They do. No idea. They are gonna drone this um, dirt hall here. Oh, and that might. That, uh, okay, he gets away. That was close. <laughs> Sardine is pushing dirt with the diffuser here. And nobody with him, so if they if he if he dies, this could be dangerous. 
I'm even holding an angle on these stairs. I'm not really sure. There's Toxic. He is roaming, so he could get caught up in this uh, flank watch here. <clears throat> Creeping through bars. See if you can find anyone hanging out. No one here, though. Just drone him. Oh, and he's off the rappel. Quid gets another kill on the sardine, and that's uh, that's case down in dirt. Yeah, we mentioned Quid that. is having a great entry day. First day in the league and doing great stuff here. Nova taking a buttload of damage here from Blunder. Bringing this down to a 5v2. Bro Ias, uh not looking too hot on this round. Around that corner. Pre-fire looking down the hole there. See if he can find anybody down in Moto. Yeah, they got uh <clears throat> they got the roam over here wait, on main stairs. Is he gonna move around though? Does he hear Maven? He does. Pre fire's the last one remaining. Oh. <clears throat> Loading new one V five situation. That's going to be a tough one for him here. Um, oh, and he gets a ping in the from a drone. And he does down him. Gets him completely taken down. Gets the kill here with a knife. Not taking any damage here. Uh, but he's looking in to see if he can find anyone. No one's over there in Moto just yet. But he does see someone down at the end of the hallway there. Yummy taking a lot of damage. But so is Pre-Fire from the smoke. And I think this one is going to end up going the way of uh, Team Conspiracy here. Smokes yeah. are just everywhere. Nothing can be done there do with 15 he, seconds left on one before. I think he has the gun skill for a 1v5 situation. But with 40 seconds left, that's, that's <clears throat> tough. Yeah, four, 15, 14, 15 seconds left and a smoke on the board that's able to just toss them out. It, it's... It's it's not going to be a good time. It's going to be very rough. And we are not at a up at four. Four all, uh, and four on row is. Hey, because they got four. <laughs> anyway, going into the next round here, we are going gym bedroom. <clears throat> they do bring the castle. Love to see a good castle play here. I'm a fan of Castle regardless of where it is. A ca a castle, honestly, is too much fun to play. Love being able to do it, especially when they gave him that uh, uh, the fourth, um, the fourth panel castle panel. wall there. Yeah. And they gave, oh, it gave him the super shorty, man. And the shoddy. Granted, they, they, took, they took the super shorty away from... Uh, As if he didn't have enough to do. Now he gets yeah. to create holes and rotates and everything else as well yeah he's honestly just running the entire map but he's, they, he's going from one side to the other to do everything given him a buff and it seems that tigers is okay never mind I'm, maybe he does know maybe that was all part of the plan you, you don't uh, have to what are you pull, talking about Willis? you don't have to pull the panels down to place the the castle Hmm. <clears throat> that would absolutely help out. Tigers takes a shot from the window. That's hell of a one tap towards the window. Very close to being a uh, entry kill. That would have been a hell of an entry kill there. <clears throat> Wonder watching yep. those switch drones. They might have a hard time getting this wall. Yeah, I don't think they're going to be able to get this one unless they send Zofia mm, nowhere, actually. Yeah, so You can't get it from underneath. Yeah, they're, they're not getting this wall. Uh, I guess they could. I bet they have um, uh, Jaegers on the wall there to keep the grenades from getting it. Yeah, it looked like they had one. <clears throat> Smoking it out, see if they can get that Twitch drone in that way. Oh, I didn't even realize they had a Twitch there. They're unable to get that oh. Twitch drone in there, so they're going to try to do a you little bit of... You need to throw it now. I'm going to save our <clears> drone in. Looks like they're rotating. Looks like... Uh, 
gonna come off of that. Hello, NS Cod. Welcome in from France. Could be I don't a, know how to say hello first. in France. <clears throat> yeah, you may be our uh, first uh, full French watcher here. A bomb has been located. Play in. Looks like they're gonna elect to play highway, and they do get the they get the charges off. They do eight. have that. We're yeah. down to a minute left, though. So are they gonna be able to get that wall open? Who is that toxic creeping? <clears throat> Pre-fire gets blunder, and it's 4v4, but Tossic is really close to swinging this. Gonna look out highway after taking a little bit of time here, getting a double? Yeah, getting a double right on that wall there. Uh, four to two, four to one now, yummy. Uh, getting a couple kills there, but Pre-fire is the last alive inside a bathroom. Gonna sit here and hold this door, wait for him to peek around, because he knows he's going to, he's got pings. Is he going to peek, or is he just going to wait? Who makes the first move? Trying to bait him out. 15 seconds remaining. Oh, and he does bait him out, but it's just <clears throat> too late. He isn't able to hit the shot. Toxic peeks out and gets him. What a shot. Knew exactly where he was almost. That was... What what a play there by Toxic being able to get around there and actually get that shot done. And five to four in way of conspiracy. This is a big round right here. Elias really needs to pick this one up. Yeah, sorry, uh, talking in, in chat here. Uh, but yeah, uh, Roas has uh, got to start doing a little extra here. Uh, actually, a lot extra to be able to uh, to bring this one uh, to, a, to a win here. Uh, coming down to a 4v5, and they got, I think, four, three. I think they got three wins off of the, uh, the 4v5, uh, which is impressive. Uh, but it looks like Team Conspiracy might have uh, uh, figured out how to potentially counter that. Well, they, this is the fact that they, they could have probably should have won if it wasn't for Quid coming in and getting those three kills. It was a 4v2. Um, they had wall. And they had a little bit of map control. They just um, weren't able to get in and get a plant, and um, Quid took advantage of that, and... Got a 3k. Let's see if they're able to get back into the same setup that they had or um, they want to go about it a different way. They are going to map this wall with Zofia watching. Um, he's going to watch this top line as he goes across. He's waiting for it this time. Learning from his past. Yeah, and that's a that's a good one to learn from. Getting fragged from there before is not a not a fun thing to have had happen. Here comes the second line, and the only issue is he can only look so far to the right now. I think being repelled on that particular wall. Wall's open. Opening it completely yeah, up he, there. He has the fantastic full, full view. <clears throat> All right, where are where are the others at here? Got one out on highway. Free fire on the balcony with Nova, and then that leaves Maven droning in rafters. Free fire gets a nade kill. This is something they are doing very well on. Those nades are lethal in the hands of Roi as Tiger's getting the majority of his health down. He's down to about a quarter health now as Maven takes a look up into the rafters. He knows where one is and he's going to try to sneak underneath Toxic and see if he can get a shot. To help. I don't think he knows that he's there, so he does end up getting Maven. Toxic is just scary and when he's is, invisible here. That is the case. 
<clears throat> Pre-fire taking some shots inside into the big hole and going into cash. We are in a 4v3 situation here with 50 seconds left. Well, they did get the case. And they get toxic. Shots going out. 3v3 here. Toxic going down. Not invisible enough, it seems. Okay, they have rafter and they have case now. And they have a better place to plant this time. And Tigers goes down, and that's a... He's not out, but he is... He is not. Yeah, I don't know if they know if he's knocked or not, but they are trying to clear out as much as possible here. Quid taking a good amount of damage. Blunder getting taken completely out. They know where Quid is. Pre-fire swinging around the side, getting the shots. Uh, but Nova actually uh, finishing off the kill. It seems, what a round. It seems like Roias um, took... They learned from their own mistakes in uh, when they went to that location in previous rounds. Uh, they didn't they didn't uh, back down off of off of their uh, initial push that time and uh, they got the got the rafters and I think the plant did did it go down completely or did they just start the plant? I think they started the plant. I never heard it actually go completely off. Could be wrong. <clears throat> I'll keep an eye on the stream here. There's only not that much time left, but uh, I, I believe the, the plant did not go down. All right. Well, they're going to go back to the basement, and I think that's probably due to the fact that they've had a harder time holding that top floor. Um, they looked pretty strong against them in these other two sites, so that is where they are going to go. They are going to have that maestro with the evil eye. The smoke is still there. And we still got the vigil on board on the room. Uh, just a quick update. They did get the plant down. It was down for about half of a second before the round ended. Okay, so plant did get down. So we will reward a plant stat. Ba -ba -ba. <clears throat> All right, let's go take a look. He's over in strip. I, I like to play strip. Like I, I don't feel like people drone it, but I feel like it gets forgotten a lot of the time. Absolutely agreed. It's one of those sites that uh, I, there's not a huge reason for a lot of people to be there. Uh, there there's never any uh, holds there. Uh, Capkin traps. It seems like both. Fire and Nova run into some cap can traps and take a lot of damage, but Quid Quid is taking a lot of damage and Prefire is down. They're pushing blue heavy. He is indeed taken out here, but Yummy taking a bit of damage. Quid need down to about half health. But so is Nova. Prefire getting a little bit of damage. Or needing a little bit of damage until he goes all the way down. But Sardine getting taken out for the first frag. Tigers on the Sardine for the headshot. People are going to sit back and hold. Maybe he gets uh, quit. An angle. Nova gets toxic. That's the rotate. That's the flank. It's 3v3. So much damage is out. Roias is sitting on slivers of health. Maven being DBNO. Nova getting taken out in pre fire. Once again, being sneezable. Oh. He does see the headshot that he could take, but unable to get it as Tigers gets the long range snap and kill and that is match point for conspiracy <clears throat> conspiracy does uh is leaving this match with at least one point here and this does uh i mean the most that row is will get is two so that's going to uh, they're still going to be up uh on the uh the what's the what's the word where all the teams are the ladder they're still going to be high up on the ladder, probably still second place. Uh, but that's going to allow for Vivid Polar to go ahead and pull ahead and get that first place, first seed going into the major. Yeah. It does appear that way, but we still, you know, they'll still have three more games after this, too. Oh, yeah. So. Well, yeah there, there's plenty le plenty of Bro League left to be, uh, to be had this season um, before we get into our major. 
Uh, so nothing to worry about. Vivid Polar still has plenty of chance to uh, either lose some more games or uh, Row Eyes has plenty more chance to win some more. So uh, nothing is set in stone, and that's the beauty of it. It's going to be exciting to watch. Hopefully be a part of. Five seconds left before insertion. All right. Attackers must locate and defuse a bomb. So here we go. Back to cash. Definitely been a site that has favored Roias um, on the attacking side. Trying to get some shots right off the bat, it looks like. Or they're opening some holes. Quid taking a taking a few shots at this ace breach on the garage and looks like they're gonna blow the wall a little bit differently this time and that's a nitro gone off the board not have to to not have to worry about gonna get some burn nades Gets a kill off of it. Doesn't get the what? wall, but he does get a kill. And that's What uh, a kill. That's bandit off the board. That's what is that now? Four or five kills that have just been from grenades? It's been quite a few, yeah. That's uh, honestly just insane. I want to So many kills being had. Okay, they're still trying to get these nades. And that'll do it. They're going to get the wall open. Nova gets quid out of rafters, and rafters is free, I believe. I don't think there's anyone there to take it. It's about cam off the board. They're getting rid of intel. Take a look and see. Toxic is not in that area to try to take rafters, so it is it is free. Free real estate. It's a, a great spot for him over there, over in the bedroom. Uh, being able to flank in pretty easily from that side when needed. Uh, we are down to a 3v4 with 45 seconds left. Uh, Ro Ias not losing a person yet. It gets pre-fire and it's 3v3 I now. take that back. We are a 3v3, yep. We got 30 seconds. They are running out of time. They're going to have to get in and either get a plant or uh, get a few more kills. There is one red. It seems they imagine that there's probably going to be someone there, but they have not been able to take the shots yet. Toxic getting a double kill here. Nova going down. I think Maven's gonna go for the plant. D4 lands. It's all up to Sardine. What? Sardine gonna go ahead and toss this plant down. Plant does go down. Gets the kill here. Unfortunately, gets taken out. And Team Conspiracy gonna come away with a win on this one, seven to five. Uh, that's not that's uncalled for. <laughs> that's, uh, that's just rude. You know that stat goes into the final stats there. That is, uh, that, that is a death. <laughs> that does mess with his KD there. So, congratulations on that. But congratulations to Team Conspiracy. You're on taking the win. Unfortunate for Row Ice that they had to end up playing the rest of this game from three round three on with a four v five. Hopefully, uh, there's no major issues with Not Okay's uh, electricity at his house. Uh, I know that it, he said that it had all gone completely out, uh, but hopefully that doesn't happen again in the future. One can hope. One can only hope. But. Uh, that being said, we do uh, not have any other matches for tonight. Um, we are looking at a triple header tomorrow night. Um, so we will see y'all then.